this weekend. It is Thursday today, July 8th. Uh, Leona has her, has her birthday on Saturday, but I won't be with her then because she will be at her father's, so I will have her birthday celebration tomorrow. So tonight I have been like wrapping gifts and arranged for her breakfast tomorrow. So this is what it looks like. It's not a breakfast, it's more like fika, but I done some balloons. People long stocking because she loves people long stocking. Uh, Tommy and Annika and the bullies. We have some pipi. <laughs> this is instead of a cake. We'll light the candle tomorrow. That is my little tiny plate and a two. She's getting, she's turning two years old, you guys. Packages. Yeah. That's what it looks like. I'm actually excited, but also, how can she be that big already? Uh, so this is just an intro. I don't know how much I will film. I don't know what, what I will. I just felt like vlogging. Okay, <laughs> love you. This has been a really rough day for me. It has been fun though, but not. All the time. <laughs> this morning began with me, uh, well, with me and Leona waking. I mean, I'm so tired, so I can't almost not talk. This uh, morning began with me and Leona getting up, and then I told her I had a surprise in the kitchen. So I uh, went with her and I started singing "Happy Birthday to You," but in Swedish, and showed her the table of all the things. But she got. She almost looked shy. I don't know why. Yam olive, yam olive, yam olive. Titta på bordet, Lana. Ut i hundrade år. Jag visst ska hon leva. Jag visst ska hon leva. Visst ska hon leva ut i hundrade år. Grattis, Leona, du fyller två år i helgen. Och Levi, hippie, höra, 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 höra. Men se du, Leona? Min mamma gjorde pipi ballonger till dig. Och fika och paket. Nånos. Det där, Lons. Vad ska jag ska göra? Vi ska tända det där ljuset till dig. Mamma svar. Ja. Stoj, bra. Ja, mamma har jättekörigt år efter den natten. Oj. Fin. Leona, har du fått ett glassbageri va? Där man kan göra glassar. Låtsasglassar. Wow. Except for the things we did, like it was fun to give him the things, and she played a lot with this, with this thing, which is what you use. Like you can make your own ice cream. It's not ice cream as you see, but you can make them look certain ways. She played with that a lot, and she got some other that she liked, and it was fun to give her. But this morning we had no water. <laughs> I don't know why we didn't. At least so. Uh, we went to her parents to eat breakfast uh, to make oatmeal. They didn't have any water either, but my dad had saved up some when he saw that it was very little water and now it's back, so it's fine. But I had so much pain, I had cramps, like my period just started and my first days are always the worst. So I had so much cramps and 
also every period since I gave birth you know I was like injured after giving birth and every period when like the first days sometimes all of the days I get the same pain I had when I just had given birth like in my pelvic, in my, uh, pelvic which hurts very 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 much so I can't really stand a lot so it hurts too much I every time I, I get that I get such respect for myself for having that for months and months and months while carrying a newborn while sleeping nothing and all of that so that's crazy and also I have heel spur I have a hurting knee my hips are hurting so I've had a really bad day I felt like in such a bad mood I felt like such a boring mom to Leona and then my parents were like we're going to a beach with some people do you want to follow us and I didn't know what to say I just felt like a teenager I'm like do I or do I not want it like I have to go there in the heat and I don't want to swim I don't want to do anything I don't want to hunt Leona because it hurts so much right now but do I want to go home and sleep and after that just sit there in my apartment like I feel like a boring mom right now so and then I asked Leona she really wanted to go so we went to the beach and hang hanged around with some people there which I really enjoyed it made me a little bit happier even though I'm very tired Leona, det, ja, det gör inget och blir lite smutsig. Det gör ingenting. <laughs> and after that we went home and ate something. And then I gave Leona a ride to her father. So she will be there for the weekend, which it always sucks. I always feel so empty when I leave her and need to go home. And I know the entire weekend is here. And I'm so tired, so I really need a rest. But then I want to start crying almost because I'm like, what am I gonna do? I know I, need, I know I have to clean and I can't really, my body can't really stand right now, but I'm gonna clean either way. I just have to do it, it has to be done. <laughs> so that is what I'm gonna do, even though it's hard. So that's step number one. And I need to take a shower. And then I'm like, what am I even gonna watch? I don't even watch movies at this moment because my Concentrate my, my concentration span is so short. I want to edit. Maybe I start editing this or edit some old reactions, but I don't really have the energy to do that either. So it's like, what am I gonna do? I get so overwhelmed and I feel like I need to do everything. And yeah, I don't know. But that's the plan for now. much more clean now not the floors but the kitchen actually do look good um, I was thinking of actually doing a lot of cleaning it hurts but sometimes but at, at the same time I feel like if I clean a lot now I don't have to clean a lot to, tomorrow I haven't one time vacuumed and swabbed the floor and everything at the same time as, I'm, as I clean. My mom has helped me a lot with the vacuum and everything and I really need to get it done myself sometime. I don't know if I can do that today or if I'm gonna do it tomorrow, but I feel like I'm just gonna clean up in a lot of rooms. I did a short vacuum session with that one, but it's just so small, so I will need to get the entire vacuum to vacuum all the floors. But I don't think I'm gonna vacuum and swab the floors. Now it's like 7.30 at night. 
But I'm gonna have to remove all these things and I don't want to time lapse that because I don't know how to put the camera because my stand is gone. So I'm just trying to find other ways to show you on camera. And it's no fun for you probably if all I'm doing is clean. But I will clean a lot this vlog because of the things I can't get done today. I hope I can get done this weekend and I just want to bring you along. It's easier for me to clean when I'm time lapsing. I don't know why, but but when I look at the time lapse, it feels so satisfying in a way. That's not my pants that are dirty. Hmm. Okay, I'm sidetracking. Uh, I'm just gonna continue on cleaning. I'm listening to podcasts now that actually Jennifer Anderson recommended to me. I just wanted to sound like I was friends with Jennifer Anderson. I'm not. Why do I have this on? It's getting even warmer with that one. I'm not friends with Jennifer Anderson. Yeah, of course, but I heard her say it in an interview. It's called uh, Smartless. It is with Jason Bateman, Sean Hayes, and Will Arnett. They are very funny guys, and they, every episode is about them interviewing somebody, and the other people don't know how they invited to in get interviewed with. So the first episode is what I'm listening to right now with Dax Shepard. I haven't gotten very far into it just. 15 minutes, but I really like it, so it's a recommendation for me, for me. Let's continue on cleaning. The thing I hate the most is unpacking bags, putting things in wardrobes and stuff. But I have a lot of bags because we went to a weekend getaway a few weeks back. I don't know if you want to see some footage of that. I can show it sometime if you are interested in it. It's, I don't didn't vlog anything, but I was going to but I didn't so this is what I'm gonna do now without time lapsing and I hope I'll get it done and we'll see what I do later I lied I regrouped my head and I think that I will just do the rooms tonight where I'm actually gonna be tonight not the bathroom even though I'm gonna take a shower I'm gonna do the kitchen the living room and the bedroom uh, because those are the rooms I'm gonna actually want to be in like hang around in like the shower I don't care I pull the curtains anyways so let's go to the living room I'm gonna show you something so it has been very warm here so first of all yesterday I bought something really expensive I had to take all my savings that I saved up to do stuff with Leona this summer and all the things I had left on PayPal to be able to do this but I feel like it's worth it in anyways because I couldn't be in my apartment earlier. I haven't been able to be here. I haven't been able to sleep because it's so warm in Sweden now. I actually bought an air conditioner or whatever it's called. It's it's there, right there. It's blowing cold air as we speak. That is why I can't even be here cleaning. And then I have this little thing here to push the coldness out to here and to my the rest of my apartment. I don't really want to have this open because I get so much bugs in here and I'm actually scared of bugs. I really don't like them. I had a problem with them in in the apartment I lived in before Tobias and ooh, I got phobia from it so every time I see those bugs it freaks me out and they start to come in so I can't even have the windows or doors open even though I have mosquito nets on so that's no fun. But what I was going to show you is there's no bed here anymore. It is a shelf there. Uh, it's a little bit messy. She got this at as birthday gifts um, these little things and uh, I actually got the houses and these ones for free on a free site where you can get things that people want to give to people don't, that don't have a lot of money and I bought the animals to it myself so she was very happy about that so that was fun but as you know it was a bed here earlier and now she actually do have a bed in here look how cozy uh, it's a little oh this looks crazy but this is very cute, I think. She has been sleeping in her bed three nights in a row and she falls asleep by herself sometimes when I go out here if she gets to listen to the music she likes in here. I get in here and I sing her songs and I talk to her and when she shouts mama, I come. But otherwise, no. She does this herself. Uh, and here I did like... I'm gonna show you this better when it's clean sometime. But I think it turns out cute. I made that, those two shelves uh, and this makeup table is here. I stutter a lot, I'm sorry for that. It looks so messy now because it is and it's very, very narrow and very crowded. And this one takes a ton of space. We have all of these things. The curtains <laughs> are ugly, but as you see, it's, uh, you need to have this outside to be able to use this as an air conditioner. So I need to like 
put stuff over the windows so number one it's dark when we're gonna sleep but number two also that the heat does not come back in so I have a whiteboard there just to hold the curtains in so it's not so bright that is because it's bright 24 7 here in um, during summer so that's not that looks not good uh, I need to make my bed and everything uh, and it hurts my heart that that looks so ugly because I really enjoy this room otherwise but I'm gonna tonight I'm gonna make it cozy somehow still I'm gonna clean and this one has to stand in the middle of everything as I always say it is what it is I won't be able to clean this so it looks nice but at least I can change the beddings the sheets are not there the other things are actually changed I can make Leona's bed, I can remove some stuff. This one doesn't have to stand here when I'm gonna be in here. So there are still things that I can do. This is the longest log with no interesting things in it. So I'm sorry for that, but I'm glad you're with me if you are. I just miss you and I like bringing you when I do stuff like this. Cleaning and shit. <laughs> So this is what it turns out like. I think it's pretty cozy if you look like here. Maybe a little bit of the bed and you see the shelves in here. That looks pretty cute and cozy. And then you look over here and you're like, oh man, this is not looking good. But then you go here and it's still a little bit cute. So I have to take the cute with the ugly. <laughs> and it's oh man, I still have my cap on. Why? I don't know. Uh, I just uh, did uh, vacuum the entire apartment, even the messy rooms. I'm not gonna swab the floor now. Floors now is oh, like 15 quarter, 15 over 8 p.m. I should ab absolutely just rest my hurting body and stuff and end this day of vlogging at least. We'll see what I do tomorrow, if I do anything more. I, this has just been like me telling stories and me cleaning otherwise uh, so I don't know but I might post it anyways I don't know I don't know I know because it's already long and we'll just see we'll just see I'll let you know you'll see if it ends or whatever but I'm gonna go take a shower I'm gonna watch some real housewives of things eat drink something and eat some snacks uh, nighty night